Welcome to Tinkernut.com's video cast. For tutorial requests, please submit those at Tinkernut.com. Alright, this week's tutorial, I'm going to show you seven different ways to speed up XP. Running the disk cleanup utility, removing cached web pages, defragmenting the hard drive, disabling indexing, disabling visual styles, editing startup items, and defragmenting the registry. Uh, that's a lot to do, so let's get started. The first thing you want to do is you want to run the disk cleanup utility in Windows. You can do this by going to Start, All Programs, Accessories, uh, System Tools, and then Disk Cleanup. And uh, just select the drive that you want to clean up and click OK, and this will remove any unnecessary files. Alright, the second thing you want to do is just remove cached web pages. So open up Internet Explorer, go to Tools, and then go to Delete Browsing History and it'll show you everything it's going to delete and then just click delete all and then you can click yes keep in mind that this does delete passwords alright this the third thing we want to do is we want to defragment the hard drive and you may want to save this one for last because it does take quite a while so go to start all programs accessories and then back to system tools again and then to disk defragmenter and if you want to know if your hard drive even needs to be defragmented, just click Analyze, and it's going to analyze uh, your, your hard drive. And whenever it's through, it's going to tell you whether it needs to be uh, uh, defragmented or not. And all this does is it just uh, compiles all the files that are on your hard drive so that they're easier to access. Alright, the fourth thing we want to do is disable indexing on the C drive. Um, and while we're doing that, just go to Start in My Computer and I'll show you how to do something else. Um, to make this open up faster, go to Tools, Folder Options, click on the View tab, and uncheck the box that says Automatically Search for Network Folders. And this will allow you to open up your My Computer folder faster. Alright, now just right click on the C drive and go to Properties and uncheck the box that says allow indexing and click apply and OK and what this will do is this will disable indexing to make your computer run faster alright the fifth thing we want to do is we want to disable windows visual styles to do this uh, right click on my computer again and go to properties and then uh, select the advanced tab and click on settings and then just select adjust for best performance and this will disable all the fancy Windows XP visual styles. Alright, the sixth thing we want to do is we want to edit Windows startup items. To do this click on start, run and go to type in msconfig and click OK. This is going to launch the system configuration utility and just click on the startup tab and this shows everything that starts up um, with your computer and a lot of these programs are not not even useful not even necessary uh, to kind of find out what they are you can either stretch it out the middle command column or just go to Google and type in the program's name and click search and you can bring up what it is for instance uh, this one is for uh, a Realtek audio device so it's my Realtek uh, sound driver so I might want to leave that enabled um, but just go through the list and uncheck anything that's not necessary and this will help your computer boot faster and then just click apply when you're through and then since we're here go ahead and click on the services tab and at the very bottom check the box that says hide all Microsoft services and then scan through whatever's left and uncheck anything that you know you don't use and then once you've done that just click close and restart your computer alright the seventh thing we want to do is defragment the registry and to do this we're going to need a special program so go open up Internet Explorer and go to hoverdesk.net slash freeware.htm and the first download link you'll come to is going to be for a program called Red Seeker so just download and uh, save it and then extract it once it's downloaded and open up the folder and double click on the program called Reg Seeker. Now in this click on the item on the left that says clean the registry and then select auto clean. And this is going to pull up all unnecessary registry files. When it's through click select all and then click on action and 
delete files and it's going to automatically back up the registry in case anything happens and then just click close. If you know any more tips please let us know and for more go to tinkernut.com.